We have news tonight of a historic discovery. A British ship sunk by a torpedo during the Second World War has been located on the ocean floor. And Jim Axelrod reports it may still be holding hundreds of millions of dollars in sunken treasure. Nearly three miles under the North Atlantic, robotic cameras captured a thrilling sight for Mark Gordon and his salvage team last week. It's amazing. We're getting to see something that's been missing for 70 years. It's the wreckage of the SS Gersapa, a 412-foot British cargo ship sunk during World War II by a Nazi U-boat. That's the actual hole made by the torpedo. She was sailing from Calcutta to Liverpool when the Gersapa went down 300 miles off the Irish coast along with a cargo of tea and silver, a lot of silver. You're looking at about over $220 million of value right now. There's potentially 7 million ounces, uh, which is 200 tons of silver laying down there. That would make this the most valuable cargo of precious metal ever recovered, although so far, the robots have only seen the tea chests. If the tea didn't float away, the silver probably didn't either. The Gersapa, with its skylights, gleaming compass, an intact bathroom is more than half a mile deeper down than the Titanic, two miles deeper than the well BP struggled to cap in the Gulf of Mexico a year ago. Luckily for us, the ship's lying upright with the cargo holds open, so it's going to be like unloading the ship along the dockside as was intended, just three miles down. Starting next spring, unmanned underwater cranes will begin salvaging the wreck, but with Gordon's company in for 80 percent of the haul, and the British government 20%, it's a matter of when they'll bring up the silver, not if. Jim Axelrod, CBS News, New York.